It's time once again for Uncle Matt's bedtime story. Hello, everybody. It's Uncle Matt, and I'm here to read you another bedtime story. And I got a story for you tonight about a parent being exhausted. Don't know about you, but uh, is your mum or dad or your grandma or grandpa, the person that's looking after you, ever tell you that they are tired, they're exhausted? Yeah, I feel that way sometimes. This story tonight is about mummy being exhausted, and it's called You Be Mummy by Carla Clark, illustrated by Zoe Persico. And uh, this story was copyright in 2020. Are you ready? Here we go. You Be Mummy. <laughs> Mummy's too tired to be mummy tonight. Can you be mummy and hold me tight? Read me a story and pat my tummy. Wipe my nose when it gets runny. Check for monsters under the bed. Sing me a song and rub my head. Can you be mummy and kiss me goodnight? Mummy's too tired to be mummy tonight. She worked all day at the computer store, came home to a big mess on the floor, helped with homework, even math, fed the dog and gave him a bath. Drove Sarah to soccer and Tommy to chess. Sewed a button on your favorite dress. Cleared the laundry and ironed the shirts. Patched up the boo-boos and hurty hurts. Can you be mummy and turn off the light? Mummy's too tired to be mummy tonight. She cooked the dinner and did the dishes, tried her best to grant all your wishes, made ice cream sundaes with extra large scoops. Look, she's exhausted. She's really pooped. And now her eyes will not stay open. That is why she's really hoping. That you'll be mummy and tuck me in. That you'll be the one to kiss my chin. So lend me your blankie and rock me to sleep. And as I drift, help me count sheep. Mummy's just too tired to stay awake. Oh, please be mummy, for goodness sake. See that big yawn? What's that, you say? You're tired, too? You'd rather me be mummy instead of you? Oh, all right, then. I'll let you win. One more big yawn, and I'll be mummy again. For you'll always be my little treasure, and I'll be mummy for ever and ever.
the end. Getting sleepy just reading that story. That's all the time we have for Uncle Matt's bedtime story. I hope you enjoyed that story, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.